hello and welcome to my youtube channel Camvis. in this video we are going to discuss a very important name reaction that is Finkelstein reaction in this reaction a primary or secondary alkyl chloride or alkyl bromide react with sodium iodide in acetone to produce alkyl iodide and sodium chloride or sodium bromide as a precipitate. Thus, here R is equal to primary or secondary alkyl group and X is equal to chloro or bromo. Sodium iodide is soluble in acetone while sodium chloride or sodium bromide are insoluble in acetone. The driving force of this reaction is insolubility of sodium chloride or sodium bromide. As the NaCl or NaBr precipitates out in solution, it shifts the equilibrium towards the product side according to leach at layers principle. For example, reaction of ethyl chloride with sodium iodide in acetone produces ethyl iodide. Reaction of benzyl chloride with sodium iodide produces benzyl iodide. Reaction of allyl chloride with sodium iodide gives allyl iodide and reaction of chloroacetone with sodium iodide gives iodoacetone mechanism. Acetone is a polar aprotic solvent which favors SN2 mechanism. Iodide ion acts as a nucleophile and alkyl halide as a substrate. Iodide ion attacks the carbon bearing halogen and at the same time halogen departs and thus leading to the formation of this transition state which then collapses to alkyl iodide and halide. A stereochemistry of Finkelstein reaction. We have just seen in the mechanism section that the Finkelstein reaction involves SN2 mechanism. So there will be inversion in configuration. Let's take S2-chlorobutane and allow it to react with sodium iodide in acetone. In this drawing, we can see that the leaving group chloro is projecting down the plane of the paper. So, in SN2 attack, the iodide ion will attack from the back side, that is, from the top of the plane of the paper like this and thus will lead to the formation of R2-iodobutane. If the reaction is performed with greater than one equivalent of sodium iodide and the reaction time is prolonged, then a racemic mixture is obtained. The reason is that R2-iodobutane is attacked by excess of sodium iodide to produce S2 iodobutane and this process continues till the equilibrium is reached. That's all in this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon if you like this video. Thank you very much for watching this video.